We often take project failure for granted, and it is time to change our paradigm. At Uruk PM, we have studied project and organizational success for over a decade. Our research has led us to know that success is possible when we consider three perspectives. Our ultimate objective is to help our clients succeed. But how do we make that happen? Let's explore the three perspectives. The first perspective is about the hierarchy of organizational success. Remember, organizations deliver value from two things, operations and projects. Operation is outside of our scope today. However, projects and the four PMs are where we add significant value. The four PMs include project, program, product, and portfolio management. Therefore, organizational success is the ultimate goal. We must have a successful portfolio and portfolio management to make that happen. Portfolio success depends on the success of its components, projects, and programs. No one can guarantee the success of every project and program. However, if the majority achieve their objectives, we will have a successful portfolio and will subsequently bridge our vision to achievements. This hierarchy of success offers an exciting way of looking at how competency and experience travel throughout the organization. Closing the hierarchy of success. Organizational success is driven by or affected by portfolio success. Portfolio success is driven by project and program success. The second perspective is about project and program success. What should we measure, how, and when? We refer you to our video on the four dimensions of project success. We embedded that model in our value delivery methodology and the Uruk platform. Dreams can only become reality with a strategy, plan, and actions. Similarly, success must be predetermined, cultivated throughout a project at every stage, and assessed through value delivery, not just task completion. We want to embed a culture where success is taken for granted. We can explain this through the PCA model and how it relates to the Uruk value delivery methodology. The P is predetermined, prepare, plan. We can wish for success or we must prepare for it. There are two steps here. Conduct a thorough feasibility study. The ultimate objective is to answer one question. Can we as an organization deliver this project successfully or not? If we believe we cannot achieve success for one reason or another, we should stop the project. The second step is that during the early stages of the project, we have to think about success and define the success criteria for all four dimensions. We need to know the destination to know we arrived. The criteria is the result of answering these questions. How are we going to determine technical success? How would we recognize project management success? How do we know if we achieve the objectives and realize the benefits? The C is cultivated, curated, and under control. The value delivery methodology is a life cycle model with decision points, gates, at critical interfaces. This approach minimizes the risks, increases delivery speed, and maximizes the chances of achieving our objectives, meaning success. It requires building the competency of our team members and conscious upskilling. The A is about achievements, assurance, and assessment. How do we assure success? It's ingrained throughout our process, embedded within our platform, workflows, forms, and policies. These elements are crafted from decades of hands-on experience in project management, spanning projects of all sizes, enabling us to build a robust framework for success. We built all these processes inside the Uruk platform to help ensure success. We must be preventive, not reactive. If we wait until the end and the project is unsuccessful, damage is done. Therefore, we must do everything we can, look ahead, look for the things that could prevent problems, and stay focused on the project's performance. That's precisely why we've developed the executive dashboard. We have the performance charts because we need to continue to monitor them, right? These resources enable us to maintain continuous monitoring of progress, ensuring we stay on track. But wait, there's more. We also utilize forecasting to anticipate potential challenges and opportunities. This comprehensive approach ensures that we're actively engaged throughout the entire project lifecycle. As we reach the end, we can assess the success. Organizational success can be taken for granted if we considered the hierarchy of success. Understand the four dimensions of project success. Follow the model of predetermined, cultivated, and achieved. Contact us today. To bring your vision to achievement, 